Hey drummers, are you tired of playing the same old drum fills in your metal drumming? You know, the ones that make your grandmother nod off to sleep? Well, fear not my drumming friends, because in this video, I'm gonna show you how to add some excitement, creativity, and originality to your metal drumming. And it'll probably get your grandmother to headbang. First off, let's break away from the traditional four on the floor pattern. Instead of sticking to a steady quarter note pattern, learn to incorporate syncopation and odd time signatures into your drum fills. They can add a lot of complexity and interest to your playing. Syncopation is the emphasis of the off beats in a measure, rather than the traditional on beats. This can create a sense of tension and release and make your fills sound more dynamic and exciting. Odd time signatures can add a sense of unpredictability to your drumming. Instead of sticking to the traditional 4-4 timing, try timings like 7-8, 5-8, or 9-8. This can make your drum fills sound that much more unique and creative, and it can help you think outside of your drumming box. When incorporating syncopation and odd time signatures in your fills, it's important to practice them thoroughly to ensure that you can execute them accurately and with precision. Start by practicing these techniques with a metronome and gradually increase the tempo as you become more comfortable with them. You can also try incorporating these techniques into your grooves and build them into your drum fills. Overall, incorporating syncopation and odd time signatures in your drum fills can make your drumming much more unique and creative. It will also help you develop your skills as a drummer and take your playing to new heights. Next, don't be afraid to add unexpected elements to your fills. Incorporate some ghost notes or play around with different sticking patterns. Experimenting with different accents and dynamics in your drum fills can add a lot of depth and interest to your playing. Accents are when you hit a specific drum or cymbal harder than the surrounding beats, and they can be used to bring attention to certain parts of your fill. Dynamics, on the other hand, refer to the volume and intensity at which you play. When experimenting with accents and dynamics, it's important to be intentful and not just playing random patterns whenever you want. These techniques should be used to enhance the overall feel and connection with the music and not just in random. Another tip for creating awesome and creative and unique drum fills is to incorporate different drumming styles inside of your drum fills. By experimenting with different drumming styles and music styles, you can draw creativity from that and bring it into your drum fills to create a whole new world of possibilities behind your drum set. Another way to incorporate different styles is to blend elements of other genres of music into your drum fills. For example, you can incorporate some jazz or funk elements into your metal drumming fills. This can add a sense of groove and syncopation to your playing and make your fills sound more unique and interesting. When incorporating different techniques and styles, it's important to master them thoroughly before you start to implement them into your drumming and your drum fills. It's also important to use them in a way that serves the music and doesn't sound out of place. Incorporating different techniques and styles in your drumming are gonna help your drum fills stand out. Try this idea out for yourself and see what kind of ideas you can draw inspiration from out of different musical genres. Now, I think this is the most important way to come up with more creative and unique fills for your metal drumming is to have fun. Now, if we just let our imagination go wild and we kind of take all these techniques and put it on the drums to see what we can come up with, that is usually the most subconscious way that we can draw all these ideas out and repeat them and practice them to master them and put them into our drumming bag of tricks, so to speak. So there you have it, some tips and tricks on creating unique and creative drum fills in metal music. If you wanna go check out this playlist right here, you can learn more about how to develop your foot technique and your hand technique and all that good stuff. Just go click the playlist now. I'll see you inside another video.